Hello and welcome back to another episode of Wasteland 3. My name is Heiken and today we're continuing the playthrough of this great game, blind playthrough on uh, Supreme Jerk difficulty, hardest difficulty in the game. And I have uh, returned to base. The base looks very, very different uh, in a positive way. Lots more of engagement here. And we've used the time to talk to Ser uh, Sergei Gretzky who has helped us to reskill our two new uh, members of the group, Marshall Kwon, aka the guy who was forced to wear a helmet with dildos, and uh, Lucia Watson, who shoots frozen uh, ferrets, I suppose. So here's the uh, rundown of what I did before we are uh, jumping right into the action. So for starters, I still think that intelligence so far remains the best skill or the best attribute I should uh, say due to the critical chance and then on top of the skill points so I really think the skill points are helpful um, our melee hogbite is going to go down the animal whisperer route and does armor modding as and when he is done with melee combat I'll see what else we can do potentially animal uh, whisperer melee combat and armor modding m maximized uh, Lucia is reskilled. We're sticking with the small arms theme, but I figured we're going to do some weird uh, science and uh, skill that higher. And I'm not sure about survival for now, but I think the small arms weird science thing isn't too bad. And maybe later on, we're just going to increase the survive uh, the first uh, first aid opportunity as well. I'm not sure about survival. Then we got our leader, Central, who still stays with automatic weapons, hard as, uh, kiss as, barter and leadership. I will put more points into leadership uh, now that we do have automatic weapon 7. Leadership seems to be really, really good and uh, we haven't used that enough. So I think that'll be the first uh, skill that uh, he is going to get up. Um, we have uh, reskilled Marshal Kwon still stuck with the automatic weapons principle but he's now a dedicated healer and mechanic and does nerd stuff and i think that really fits him quite well because he is in the middle does have a decent armor overall and also survivability and then mechanics and nerd stuff we hadn't uh, really covered so far ramos stays with the big guns explosives lock picking and weapon modding so has three skills to take care of and murphy the small arm sniper rifles the sneaky uh, bits and i am thinking about what else we could give him a little bit later uh, so in terms of guns we got automatic weapons big guns uh, we got melee only thing that i haven't done is brawling but i'm not yet fully understanding the advantage of that we got animal whisperer we got explosives, we got weird signs, armor and modding and uh, weapon modding is definitely done. Toaster repair I'm not understanding yet. There must be kind of a joke that I don't fully get. So it's the only skill that I haven't gotten. Survival, nerd stuff, mechanics, lockpicking and all of the social skills are there. So maybe Lucia, once she's done, with uh, her build which will not require that many points i think she can get uh, the the toaster uh, the other thing that i learned is skill books are important so we're going to uh, really just go all the way to nine and hope for a skill book uh, book to drop when i reskilled kwon what i noticed is um, he now uh, received six points for uh, the mechanic skill book that he read so apparently it's not lost the one thing that i will say though is lucia watson uh, with reskilling does i think have lost her one individual perk where she had that quick shot i'm not 100 percent sure let's just double check yeah, she lost it. She only has trick shot now, but she lost her original perk. I have no idea how we can get that back but because I haven't seen it. But yeah, that's a bit unfortunate. Wasn't uh, wasn't planning to lose that. But in return, we got uh, a more focused character. So 
What is in uh, to store for today? So we got uh, Full House, which is more or less green. Gretzky suggested we build up the base before the Patrick is out. Gretzky suggested we speak with Sheriff Daisy, who can found uh, blah, blah, blah. He thinks she may be able to find us some recruits. Now that we have a functional medical bay, left by a doctor, we can tend to our wounded and provide healing supplies. And we have someone to, um, we found someone to manage our brick. Prisoners are well kept, which means we're pretty far um, in that. Uh, we do have unwelcome guests next, which uh, seems to be something in Colorado Springs. So that is an option. And we still have the neighbor quests, uh, which I want to uh, go for. So that's going to be the next quest. We also healed up, healed all of our injuries. And as you can see, we changed the pistol a little bit. Uh, we now got a nice little laser pistol. And apparently laser weapons or uh, weapons with alternative um, damage types always have a massive penetration. Uh, so I'm not sure if that uh, if armor even helps against them. It seems it does not, which is funny. Good, let's do the uh, quest and talk to our good friend, uh, the sheriff once again. I think she has already given us all of the help that we could ask her of. Come in, Team November. Ranger HQ here. A squad of BAMs rolled up to Ranger HQ. Rough mercenary types. Their leader goes by Gary Wolf. Claims to be an ex-Ranger. Says he has news for you about your old enemy. Seems like the cutthroat take no prisoner type. Over. Are they causing any problems? Some hurt feelings and broken pottery, maybe, but they appear to be friendlies. Old enemy? No idea. Your guess is as good as mine. Copy that, Ranger HQ. We'll check we'll it out. Here. Over and out. Okay, there's essentially the next quest afterwards. For now, our filling the Ranger AQ quest still suggested we should go to Sheriff Daisy. What do you need, Rangers? Now that we've um, acquainted, we have a delicate question. The Patrick appears to be in poor health. Who steps in when he dies? Why? Want me to say it should be you? Uh, the Rangers could keep Colorado safe if we had the right friends. Well, I can't argue with that. Not even the Patriarch could go it alone. Wouldn't have got half as far without the Marshals. See, we all know the important folk around here, and we have an understanding with most of them. So, whoever runs this town when the Patriarch is gone, there need to be real good friends with me. All right, you said the next leader of Colorado will need to be uh, need the friendship of the marshals. So we're friends now. I like you, Rangers, but a girl needs to be sure before she commits, if you know what I mean. We ain't quite Roger that. What do you need, Rangers? I like you, Rangers, but a girl needs to be Roger. Okay. That. Well, we need to do more quests apparently. Would you rather also, I filled uh, our reserves. We do have 12 and 13. So in case we're getting shot at again, we should be fine. By the way, I forgot to mention it. It is episode number seven and we're still only at one death. I am quite proud of that, specifically since the death was in episode one. Good. Sans Lux. Let's go, baby. Yeah, this is the Sans Lux apartment. Who's there? The Desert Rangers, Mrs. Wong. Good. This is going to go only one way. I can already see that we are running into a nice little fight. Rosie Wong is waiting for you to enter, smoking a cigarette. Uh, see, she smiles when she sees you. Her teeth are the color of caramel corn. I can't believe you came. Those goddamn marshals never come. They think I'm a pest. 
I'm vigilant is what I am. V I G I L <laughs> A N T. Anyhow, I hope you're ready for trouble, Rangers. Cause I got a situation here. Oh, come on, Rosie. I always came when you called, didn't I? You're with the Rangers now, Quan? Well, you were one of the better ones. I'm glad you're out of that martial racket. What seems to be the trouble? In room three, Irv. He's not supposed to have anybody else living there, but I hear voices in there all the time. They're always banging on stuff, and I can smell burning and bleach, and I don't know what else. Make him stop it or throw him out. Either one is fine with me. Have you looked inside of the room? Yeah. The shifty bastard's put his own locks on the door. That's how I know he's up to no good. Apartment room three. End of the long hallway. I know he's up to something. I just know it. Okay, Rosie. We got it. It is so fitting that she's a cat lady. Nice. What does the cigar uh, do? Ten crit chance. Okay, so all of the smoke basically do the same. Level 5 chest armor. Wait, wait, wait. So these things have 3 armor and crit chance. And these helmets here only have 4 armor. Um, yeah, I think we're just going to take the crit chance. These helmets are very, very good. I mean, Quan looks a little bit weird with his helmet, but everybody else seems to enjoy the helmets. <clears throat> Armor 4. Good. Well. Cool. By the way, we got new crafting recipes. Just want to sh uh, show you that. Antidote. We got uh, the searcher kit, we got med kits, 20 a pop, Ooh, that's expensive. We got hypo, we got injury kits, hypo is like what, 39 a pop, wow. And we got some antidotes, that's actually uh, surprisingly cheap, so might as well go for it. Like it. Uh, these uh, searcher kits aren't bad either. Again, might create a couple of those. Cool. Fuck off. Good. What is Frank Pepper's problem? Huh? Get the fuck out of my apartment. Well, I can see that problem. Rainbow tables used to break encryption. Meet space demons intercepted. Display rendered objects and assigned translation vectors. Okay. Is he one of the walking robots? What are you offering us? Variable detection grid populated by live stream data. No thanks. Nice symbol. Repeating coroutine. Oh, really? We aren't taking it. Refactor required. 
support disabling implicit wig set operation. Interesting guy. I like that there are always a couple of really, really strange characters around. They hit the tone of the world so perfectly. There is always a bit of curiosity and you never fully know if the guy is just absolutely insane or if you're missing out on the biggest secret ever. Good. Some alcohol and some crafting recipe. How, how, how is the crafting recipe, by the way, going? Um, all right, crafting. So we got a mystery item. Football, human bones, muscle tissues, toe, tongue. Okay, whatever. There's another toaster. That whole toaster repair thing, I don't fully get it. Maybe I should have skilled into it, but let's stick with the skills that we already do have. Uh, someone was alarmed back here. But how do we get into that apartment? Why haven't you gone in yet? Kick down that door. We don't have five lock picking, that's why we haven't gotten in there. One, three, five, seven, eleven, eleven. They must never know. No one must ever tell them. What's my name? Why don't you tell me my name? Okay, somehow we can home see again, through the door. Again. Jug -a -de -jug -a -de -jug. And it says IRV clone. The at last. Eureka, the secret at last. I am a human just like you. I swim as cup schmiddle to Sacramento, California. I can see my own cells. Thank you so much. You have been the most gracious of hosts. One, three, five, seven, eleven, eleven, and eleven. Sacramento, California. What the actual F? Oh, come on, how could you hit your own guys? Unbelievable that 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 actually works. <laughs> you can hit your own guy. How is that even a thing? Okay, we're going to try again. This time, stay back, and let the professionals handle that. Good. Game is saved. Uh, this might turn out quite ugly. I can see my own self. Okay, we got an explosive nitro tank here. We can disable that over there. If Quan can go all the way. Pop 
by the world, man! God, the greatest mind of a generation thrown down the chasm and black. Good. Quan. One, three, five, seven, four. Carefully moves to here. Oh, wait, that's not Quan. Well, never mind. Come on. I can see my own Oh, well, they do have shrink grenades. How many actions do they even have? What's my name? Why don't you tell me my name? You want a brawl? Knock yourself out. <laughs> wow! What is happening? Alright, hog bite. Heals you. Then begins to drink. Oh, it's going to be a tough fight, man. Can already see it. Thank you, kind. We gotta disable this. Hit the generator. stay in the open but we're nicely flanked so that's a problem can we hit that generator somehow no we can only disable it Quan needs to get up has a lame leg, which is potentially the worst thing that could happen. Moves into cover. And just hunkers down for now. Can't get both of them down. We can give them a minus to hit chance. There's another nitrogen tank. 3 AP and 4 AP doesn't check out. We need to survive first. That's the biggest problem. Take over the AP to next round. Hogbite moves in. Alright, central. Let's offer them alternative. Let's offer them alternative uh, targets. We do have 11. Can we move somewhere for five? Well, that'll be quite in the open. That'll be okay ish.
lots of crits nice little uh, hit and we're taking 2 AP over Well, that's unfortunately not going to be good enough. Do nice. Calling it uh, quits here and do the quick load. Second death. It's tough. Very tough. So... We need to get to here and disable it. Eureka! The secret at last! God, the greatest mind of a generation. Blown down the gentleman class. I can see my own self. What's my name? Why don't you tell me my name? The square of the hippopotamus is three times the length of its arm. Okay, we can't move through here. Nitrogen tanks aren't as great as you think they would be. This here was pretty much a death zone. And we got hit by the shrink grenade, which just didn't make it any better. We could pull it out, just stand here. And hit that light turret gun. What's the radius of it? Might be, for all, all we know, very far. From the entrance, only the sniper can reach it. That's not an option either. So how do we uh, crack that nut? Good, Quan definitely needs to get in there somehow. Lucia reloads. I am a human just like you. I swim as cup schmiddle to Good, we need to do it better this time. Is this hiding us? See my own selves. They must never know. No one must ever tell them. Don't want to again be jumped on by all of these guys. The voice lines are aggravating. Eleven and eleven. I can see. World is ours, Josephine. Shrink grenade. Oh, it's so stupid. They do have a strong laser weapon. Yeah, 
All right, Quan, even if he goes down. <coughs> takes down that machine. That is helpful. Very helpful indeed. Central. Heals himself. Occupied drinks. And then uh, heals himself as well. What does shrinking do? More evasion, but less damage overall. And we are going to move in, mainly because we need to rescue Quan next round. Why do we have such bad odds in hitting anything here? All right, pistol time. Lucia moves in. Um, if we hit the arms, reduces target's hit chance. Body. Bonus damage, targets armor reduced, combat speed. No, 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 we want to reduce their damage output. Very nice hit. Central continues to move up. And... Starts focusing here. A little bit of damage, not not a lot. The cat is taking vital positions. I don't like that at all. Ramos into cover. And begins to hit both of these guys. The nitrogen has given her freezing, whatever that does, but I hope it'll reduce her uh, accuracy. Bonus damage, we already reduced her accuracy, so... Well, that's one way. The question is, we are not uh, pumping through 500 points of damage, but what we can do is we can reduce her arms. Nice little crit, crippled as well. Wow, so much damage, holy! Central moves up. And Central is pissed, so we're going to spray and pray. Yeah, that would be a bit too much. Ah, I am a human. 
coming, just like you. We have uh, removed all of uh, the armor, which is good. Murphy. All of the clones took some damage. 300. Shotgun too far away, so we're focusing on dealing more damage. Nice little crit, by the way, down to 150. Lucia gets up, or gets uh, her colleague up. And we need to counter heal. I mean, that's the only thing that we really can do at this point. Couple of good heals. Moving to here so that we're not... That we're not easily targeted 21 50 percent thirty I mean this year this year would be the right this would be the right move in order to get one of the clones down. Might as well need to do it because they are hitting most of the time anyways and getting one down or near down. It's going to be so helpful. Well, we are super shrunk now. Not bad, not bad. Things are go uh, looking up. Sort of. That put could be a crit kill. Instead, it's just a hit. Ramos heals himself. And just goes all out. Take some cover over here, which is good. Occupied revives. And Quan could place a decoy, but that wouldn't really work. Funny that I have forgotten that we even have decoys. Should have placed that. Uh, hacker robot temporarily converting them to become an ally. Are these robots? They are clones, so no, it's not the same as a robot. This might trigger another grenade. Who knows? Our next target should be the clone here. No. Trying to go for a trick shot. Nice hit. Next shot can really reduce her arms. God, that's less uh, chance to hit us. And we got a shrink grenade. Less damage. Good. Well, how do you feel being shrunk, huh? Isn't that great, right? I figured you wouldn't like it. Reloading. Of 
great hit absolutely fantastic central is rocking it i like what i'm seeing and Quan needs a round of just hunkering down okay triple shot oh my lord well second time is the charm right this fight goes much better than the first one Lucia, trick shot into this time head damage. I like it. Into more hits. Quan uh, is putting out one of these decoys. Want to test them? And then scores a kill. Love it. Ramos moves into a good position and gives himself a nice little heal. One of those times where Murphy switches to the shotgun. Barely not making it. But you know what? The Murphy begins to move. Uh oh. Didn't know it re um, moves cover that efficiently, but we got a decoy, so we should be fine, right? Right? Hogbite moves up as a little ant and teaches that clone a lesson. Uh, might as well just move a little bit back. Oh, that decoy is good. What's my name? Why don't you tell me my name? Miss, come on. Nice little crit hit. I like that. Switching to assault rifle. Moves up, gives everybody leadership. One has a couple of hits, I like that as well. And if we're too close, our heavy gun doesn't work. Uh oh. No, 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 no. Unbelievable. But the decoy just does take all of the damage. She, for whatever reason, heals for 160. One hit. Oh yeah, and that super strike. Unfortunately not a crit this time, but I remember that that strike really, really hits hard. Uh, 
Onto the head. Wow, look at how much damage that guy is eating. All right, death number two. Deserved it. Didn't understand the stealth mechanic correctly. And we were not clumping up very, very well. Pulse gun, level 10 assault rifle. Oh, holy, that is good. Unfortunately, just one of them. And I have to wonder, what does it require? Does it require uh, just automatic weapons? Okay. You know what? It could be... Nah, Quan already has a good assault rifle, his own, the converter. Central now has a wonderful pulse gun. Getting some ammunition back. Okay. Let's figure out what happened here. Yeah, they do have a lot of stuff, which I do understand, because if you think about it, The readout graphic uh, flatline now that the clones are dead, given specific, uh, specific knowledge uh, and the right resource might be possible to, to make more. Okay, so you could effectively clone something in that cloning device. Anything, really. Research notes. Okay. On the desk you find a chaotic mess of ancient uh, dot matrix printout, scientific journals and a dog-eared um, bookmark. Uh, notes are scrambled upon the wild childish hand. Computer awaits a button press. Begin the experiment. No subject found on the primary. Ah, uh, Doggo is okay. We don't need to involve him into that experiment. Sandra moves here. And Quan, the poor uh, fellow, moves over here. Murphy's going to mash a couple of buttons. What could possibly go wrong? Cloning in our time. Robotic cybernetic cloning, cloning in practice, everlasting pro um, Find and confront Earth with what you've discovered in his department. The question is, where is Earth? And what did we get, by the way? So, we got a twisted arm. We got the stink. Can only be removed by a Dr. NPC. Well, fantastic. And we got the third eye. Uh, critical chance plus 5%. Can only be removed by no glow. Why would you remove it? It is plus 5 crit. There's some more lock picking available here. So, uh, find and confront Earth with what you've discovered. Written by Irvin John uh, Finister, uh, Finster, an old enemy of the Rangers. Where do we find Earth? I think we are, first of all, saying thank you here. 
Rosie, so, good job. What'd you find in a park? Was he making bombs like I said? Weirder how? Your talent has been associated with a dangerous scientist. Uh, he also has a cloning mis uh, machines. Yeah, you were right. That's weirder than making bombs. Can I at least go in and clean up? Please stay out there until we find him. Uh, his security deposit's not gonna cover the repairs, is it? If he wasn't in his apartment, then he's probably at the bookshop in Market Square. Look for a skinny guy, always wearing a lab coat. Let me know what happens. All right. Market Square. That's the info that I needed. That guy has a bit of explaining to do and his clones were mighty strong. But we got a nice little assault rifle out of it. Although we paid with one death. Seven episodes, two death. Not too bad. Where's the bookstore? Market Square. Clothes, I think around the market square is what she said. Oh, and by the way, we got uh, leveling up. Fantastic. So Hogbite can finally finish his intelligence, which is good. Um, you know what? Continue with melee combat. <clears throat> no, no, wait, 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 wait. Animal Whisperer had... Oh, no, we already have five, which is the spirit. That's exactly what we wanted to do. So, if you move more than three spaces, your next bladed attack has a higher chance of critical chance uh, hit. Take the same target twice in a row with a bladed weapon and make a free bonus attack. I think that is what we wanted. Seems like a no-brainer to me. Good, we're having Central. Central continues with his Charisma. By the way, 2-4 coordination is good. Going with the Charisma route. And we wanted Leadership to be leveled up. Has three points, puts one in Leadership. Yeah, that's okay. All right, Ramos. <clears throat> we waited for perk, right? Yeah, the steady shot perk. And you sort of are almost leveled up, so that's not too bad. Bookseller. There's Earth. Hello, Earth. What's the matter? A tall, lanky man looking over the books uh, on a merchant stand, muttering nervously to himself. Um, hi. Mind if we ask you some um, questions? I guess. Wh who are you? With the Desert Rangers, we've been having around in Colorado Springs. Is your name Earth? I. I. I'm Earth. Wh what do you want? We found some papers in your apartment written by Irvin John Finister. Is that your real name? I, uh... Please don't I tell... tell the marshals, but I'm one of his clones. Unfortunately, I'm fourth generation, at least. So I'm not as smart as the original. He's smart enough to, to use Dr. Finster's notes to get the cloning machine working again, but... But not smart enough to make good quality clones. I can't even make one as good as myself, and I'm not that good. Bits of me don't work very well at all. We were attacked in your apartment by a few guys who look just like you. Any explanation for that? Oh no! Did you kill them? I'm afraid we had to, sorry. Oh, oh poor clones. They... they never really acted right. I, I, I screwed up the formula somehow. Tell us about these clones. Well, well, I, I guess I'm kind of 
afraid to make friends the normal way, so I made them an abnormal way. Only, I didn't do it very well. When they came out of the chamber, there was something wrong with them. They were really, really stupid and, and really, really crazy. And they, they just got crazier day by day. If, if I hadn't run out of the apartment today, they would have killed me. I'm a bad father. I'm That's not really fatherhood. Father. What do you know about uh, Doc Finster? Oh, Dr. Finster was a genius. He's the only person in the world to have mastered the cloning of humans. He, he may have become a little paranoid at the end, but that doesn't lessen any of the good he gave to the world until he decided all humans had to die. He was a real humanitarian. Is Finster still alive? The original? No, n not anymore, but I guess in a way, as long as I'm alive, he is too, because I'm him, aren't I? Or, I mean, I'm him, but not the part of him that wanted to wipe out the entire human race, right? Yeah? I, I wasn't, I wasn't suggesting, no. You know the whole nature versus nurture debate, how some things are genetic and some things you learn? Well, that killing everybody part of him, that was nurture. He, he, he wasn't born that way, and, 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 uh, and neither am I. I swear, you believe me, don't you? We believe you are no, 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 no. We believe your story. Oh, thank God. So, you're not gonna arrest me. We're not, in fact, uh, we bring your cloning machine. Um, well, you're welcome at the ranger's headquarter. We can use a scientist like you. You're gonna let me be a real scientist? This is the best! Thank you so much! I hope I don't regret that later. Books for sale! All the classics! I hope I don't regret that later. That's kind of creepy. Yeah. Always watching. Hey, Jones! Welcome to Taiwan Jones's Emporium! My store Sardinely! Good. Um, yeah, we got a lot of grenades, which is good. Confetti grenade. Throw to unleash harmless confetti. That needs to go. Good, what else needs to go? We do have a few lower level weapons. We don't need the brawling weapon. And I think most of the armor can go now uh, at this point as well. We just need some money just to have the funds to always continue our medical expenses, which are mounting up at this point. This game is becoming expensive. Marksman rifle, auto shotgun. Luckily, some of the weapons are at least covering for it. Not the lower ones, though. Okay, we good. Let's just double check our medic. Also does have the mechanics. Maybe we we'll, we are going to give them the perk for an extra slot. I like the machine turret. I very much like the decoy. The decoy was great. Uh, the decoy meta effect was so great that I'm wondering, can we craft decoys? Yes, we can. But that requires LED matrices. Hmm. Machine turrets aren't bad either. But it costs a lot of scraps to uh, get them going. Alright, in any case, I think... I think for now, we're just going to use the machine, uh, the, uh, the machine turret.
Murphy did well. Central with a gas grenade. I don't know. Is the gas grenade really helpful? I haven't really used it. Gain 3 AP, but then suffer evasion afterwards. That's a good item. But it is drugs after all. So I wonder, poison status removal, yellow snow, nah, I think the uh, the grenade is still good. Shrink grenades were okay, they are just re uh, removing damage and some more alcohol on hog bite. Cool. So we definitely need to heal and I'll do that uh, off screen. But in the meantime, last time we checked, not all of the weapons were reloaded and that really sucked. Plus we don't have a rocket at the moment so that's another thing that we might need to craft ammunition energy cells frozen ferret can't really create rockets so we need to keep them a little bit better grenades are good but they cost way too much. Molotov cocktail also not bad. All of the armor upgrades, yeah. Okay. So we're going uh, to head back to the base. Unwelcome guests. Talk to... Okay, unwelcome guests, that's done. Return to Rosie. Okay. Let me return to Rosie real quick, then we're healing up because we still have a couple of wounds and then we're going to do the next uh, quest. But I think that'll happen in the next episode, so maybe we're just cutting it short here, guys. Um, if uh, you want to see more Wasteland, uh, then leave a comment and a like down below because that helps uh, the episodes to go quote-unquote viral. And uh, always remember, if you don't hit that like button, you might find uh, yourself uh, overwhelmed by a couple of clones that I put up uh, that will punch you. Thank you and have a good one. Bye-bye.